Israel is mostly desert so it has always had a big problem, not enough water. With more people and farms needing water, the little bit Israel had wasn't enough. This wasn't just bad for the environment, it was a real danger to the young country. Not enough rain and no big rivers made it hard for Israel to grow. The Jordan River, an important source of fresh water, caused arguments with nearby countries. Fighting over water made it even harder to get enough. Israel needed new ideas and everyone had to work together to fix this problem. The government knew this was serious. This led to smart new inventions and plans that changed everything about water in Israel. Israel had a big water problem, so it started a huge project, the National Water Carrier. This ambitious initiative was designed to address the country's chronic water shortages and ensure a stable water supply for its growing population and agricultural needs. Finished in 1964, this giant project showed how much Israel wanted to fix its water problem. It was a monumental achievement that demonstrated the nation's commitment to overcoming its environmental challenges through innovation and determination. The National Water Carrier was built to move water from the Sea of Galilee, Israel's biggest freshwater lake, to the dry south. This engineering marvel spanned hundreds of kilometers, ensuring that even the most arid regions could benefit from the precious resource. This amazing project helped farms grow food where nothing grew before. The transformation of barren lands into fertile fields was nothing short of miraculous, providing a lifeline for farmers and boosting the nation's food production. With water, farmers grew more food and used more land. The availability of water allowed for the expansion of agricultural activities leading to increased crop yields and more efficient use of land resources. Israel went from not having enough food to having extra food to sell to other countries. This surplus not only ensured food security for its citizens but also turned Israel into a significant exporter of agricultural products. Using the Sea of Galilee for farming used a lot of its water. The heavy reliance on this vital water source raised concerns about sustainability and the long-term health of the lake. Israel knew it couldn't only use natural water so it started looking for other ideas. The search for alternative water sources led to groundbreaking research and the development of new technologies. Desalination, making ocean water safe to drink, looked like a good solution. This innovative approach promised to provide a virtually limitless supply of fresh water by harnessing the vast resources of the sea. These changes were important for Israel's water, moving from saving water to making new water. The shift from conservation to creation marked a new era in water management, ensuring a sustainable future for generations to come. Israel kept working on desalination, a process that removes salt and other impurities from seawater to make it drinkable. They saw the Mediterranean Sea as a huge source of water, so they put lots of money into research, development and innovation. Israel's engineers and scientists worked hard to make desalination better and cheaper, constantly improving the technology and efficiency. Over time Israel became the best at desalination, with some of the biggest and best desalination plants in the world setting global standards. These plants, strategically located along the coast, now make a lot of Israel's drinking water, ensuring a steady supply. The Sorek plant, one of the world's biggest, makes a huge 624,000 cubic meters of drinking water every day, enough for almost 2 million people, showcasing Israel's technological prowess. Desalination helped Israel get more water and changed how they see the sea from a salty wall to a source of life, transforming their relationship with the environment. Cities and towns that used to be short on water now have plenty of safe water, improving the quality of life for many residents. Desalination gave Israel water security they never thought possible, showing that even deserts can have fresh water if people are clever enough, turning arid lands into thriving communities. Using every drop wastewater treatment and water reuse. Israel is also good at saving water. Knowing that wastewater is useful, Israel cleans and reuses it. Today, Israel cleans almost 90% of its wastewater, more than any other country. This cleaned water is used for farms, saving fresh water. Israel's wastewater cleaning works because of good technology and smart planning. Israel built high-tech cleaning centers that remove bad stuff from wastewater, making it safe for farms. Farmers can now water crops without using precious fresh water. Israel shows that we can rethink how we see water, turning waste into something useful. Looking ahead, challenges and opportunities for a water-secure future. Even though Israel is great at managing water, it still has problems. The country has made significant strides in water technology and conservation, but challenges remain. Climate change is a big threat with hotter weather and different rainfall making water scarcity worse. These changes affect agriculture, water supply and overall ecosystem health. 
The shrinking Dead Sea because less water comes from the Jordan River is another worry. This not only impacts the environment but also the local economy and tourism. Israel keeps researching and finding new ways to solve its water problems. Scientists and engineers are constantly innovating to develop sustainable solutions. From plants that don't need much water to getting water from the air, Israel is leading the way. These innovations are crucial for adapting to a changing climate. Israel's story gives hope to other countries with water problems, showing that even the hardest problems can be solved. International collaborations are key to sharing these solutions. Israel went from almost no water to being the best at water, showing how smart and strong people can be. This transformation is a testament to human ingenuity and resilience. As the world faces bigger water problems, Israel's story gives hope and a clear message. Even in the driest places, we can have plenty of water. The future of water security depends on innovation, collaboration, and determination.